breathes fire. That's what we've got to call him. He who breathes fire. In the local Swahili language, that translates to Ane Pumua Moto. Ane Pumua Moto. He who breathes fire. Nobody's gonna mess with the pride with he who breathes fire as the guardian. He must be 180 kilograms and as big as a lion gets. Yeah, Ane Pumua Moto looks to be five years old and in his prime. And that's his job to guard the lionesses anywhere from two to 20, plus his cubs, from danger. Of the 36 species of wildcat, lions are the only ones that live in a big social group. A big old family. Uh, then where's he going? Mm -hmm. <gasps> All right, yeah! Woohoo! He's going on patrol! Every few nights or so, he'll patrol the pride's territory to make sure there is no intruder, like other lions around. He doesn't wait for trouble to come. He goes out to stop it. Yeah, but what if Trouble finds the pride while he's gone? Well, the lioness are tough, but if Trouble shows up that they really need help with, like a really big clan of hyenas or other male lions, the lioness will call for the lion and he'll come charging back. Saving the pride with the lion powers. Uh, where's he going? Are you kidding? When a lion of a pride trots off to survey the territory, what do you think we do? Have a catnap in the Criterra? No way! We're going on lion patrol! Naturally. Take your time. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> He's marking his territory. Weird how a lion pees backwards. Male dogs lift legs, male cats spray backwards. Hey, while we track him, let's map his territory. Yes, because this termite mound is like a signpost on the edge of his territory. And his pee is like a message to other lines that says, Keep out. Trespassers will be attacked and maimed and in other ways have a very bad day. Uh, something like that. Engaging map actuator. While we track him, let's charge his territory, and we'll end up with a map of the Ne Pumuamoto Kingdom. <gasps> Looks like he's on the prowl. Let's move! They are so cute! Hey, you want to do something a little different today? Sure. This time, why don't we name all the lion cubs? Yeah, why not? And we'll surprise Martin when he gets back. I'll name him Lil Cubby. <laughs> and that one's El Cutissimo. <laughs> wow. He really is the king of beasts. Chris, what's going on over there? He's watching over there. <laughs> what's that? <laughs> Something's spooking them. What? You're spooking me. A clouded leopard. You didn't say clouded leopard, did you? Yeah. She's hunting the monkeys, a top monkey predator. And guess what, Martin? More good news? Looks like that's your main job. You're the guard of the troop. The males watch out for danger while everyone else eats. Just use your nose to give the alarm call if you see a predator. Except for one little problem. What? I still don't have the nose alarm down. Well, you better get it down fast because that leopard just disappeared. I lost track of him. Okay. Don't worry, Nosy. I'm on the lookout. Oh, I wish a clouded leopard was easier to see. He could be anywhere with that camouflage. He'll just blend right in with the shadowy forest. Better practice the alarm call, just in case... <gasps> no! 
what kind of proboscis monkey has a squeaky toy for an alarm call? Huh? <laughs> 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 Sorry! False alarm! Whoa! It was there the whole time! in a wild place is never a good sign. Serval! Tiger! Serval! Tiger! Help! Nina? Zaka sent his Zack box to catch a black jaguar. Jaguar it is. Let's get this wildcat expedition going! Wildcat style! Finally! Yes, we're going to Central America! Wahoo! Vamonos! Jimmy, wake up! Time to go! I got this one. Jimmy, your controller fell out the window and is falling to Central America. Huh? My controller? I've got to go get it! Maybe that was just a titch too dramatic, Martin. Yeah, maybe just a titch. Huh? Hey, my controller was right here the whole time. Jimmy and I will stay here to make sure Zack doesn't try any funny business. Wow, you got here fast. Hola, Nina. Hey, Nina. Thanks for the Jaguar alarm. Wahoo! Which way did the Zack box go? Every way. Whew, this is a tough one. How are we going to find a black Jaguar before Zack when any Jaguar, black or orange, is so hard to find in the first place? Yeah, even though they are so big, the biggest cat in the Western Hemisphere, by the way, they are so secretive. They're harder to see than the camouflage tortuga. The tortuga? Where's the tortuga? Exactly. Hey, our best bet would be to find some jaguar spotting experts. And then they could help us. You're on. Jaguar spotting experts? Like putting spots on a jaguar? Or do you mean spotting, like seeing jaguars? Crab Rose, wait up! You know, creatures like spider monkeys, pacas, white-lipped peccaries, rainforest deer. Oh, I get it. Animals that a jaguar hunts. That's right, because these animals have to spot a jaguar before the jaguar spots them for survival. So, if we can find an animal who is the prey of a jaguar, like the spider monkey, for example, if they spotted Jaguar, they would make a warning call. Whoa. Yeah, sort of like that. Then we would know there's a Jaguar around. <laughs> ah, yes, the spider monkey along. Maybe they spotted a Jaguar. <laughs> What great camouflage. The jaguar's orange and black spotted pattern blends in with the beams of light and shadows of the forest floor, and the jaguar can virtually disappear. I bet a jaguar could sneak up behind you and you wouldn't even know it was there. We would know, wouldn't we? Well, yeah, of course we would. 